hi everyone uh, welcome back to my channel um, thank you for tuning into this video today um, following the feedback that I got from my last video I was aware that some people couldn't hear me at all with the voiceover so hopefully you can actually hear me this time around so um, this video today is all about sharing how I take my beautiful notes and the type of things I use to take my notes so what I use mostly when I want to take my notes is um, I use my white lines paper in A4 um, that I got from Amazon. I'll put the link down below. And the reason why I use white lines is because I started using it and it's been very good so far. And I just love the feeling and the fact that I can actually study my notes while on the go or while traveling as well. So that's very, very important. And the page, I use the um, the great the great style one of white lines because it just makes a lot of sense when I'm writing compared to um, using a straight line. I've not tried their straight line, um, their lined ones, but I'm I'm loving just um, the great style ones at the moment anyway. And then um, this is how my notes looks like from past notes. This is how it is. It just looks really really good where you can actually see your notes in the middle of white lines and you're not worried about something getting involved when you draw diagrams and stuff like that so that's just why i use white lines and i actually got the motivation to use it from zoe studies so that was a good uh thing even though uh, she's our well, instagram page down below so you can follow her page as well the next thing i try to use whenever i'm making my notes is my already um annotated printed lecture slides this is because anytime I go to lectures, I always have them printed because, uh, and then make my notes after because I can easily write out stuff that the um, lecturers, um, the points the lecturers are making, but on the slides. And then when I'm making my notes, I can implement that into my notes. So for today, this is the lecture I'll be making up the notes about. It's about um, glucose metabolism. So that's my lecture slide, annotated, highlighted for the important points. So the next thing I have is my Tombow brush pen in black. I just use this mostly for my head and for my topic or headlines. And I also like to pick a color theme for every note I want to make. This time around, I'm using a, um, a color purple and I'm using a highlighter that a friend of mine got for me from Hong Kong, which is very, very good. Which is to say, you don't need anything expensive to make up your notes. You can just use any highlighters as cheap as possible and just something to just make it to personalize your notes to make it stand out for yourself. I'm also my, using my Muji pen in 0.05 tape in color purple as well. I have a piece of ruler. And I also have um, little um, sticky notes where I can use to annotate while I'm writing things like um, important definitions, important things that I can need to know. And I use my go to black pen, which is just trim to open three It's just very fine, and I just love the tips. So that's all I need to make up my notes. I don't need anything uh, massive to make up my notes. I just need something to personalize it to myself. And making notes is kind of like a personal thing. It's something you know that when you want to actually study, you're happy to read through what you've made and you would understand. Another important thing that I tend to have when I'm making my notes is my headphones. And this is because sometimes if I'm using my lecture slides, I sometimes have my laptop as well to watch screencast quickly of all that something the lecturer said that I did not remember to annotate. So I wasn't quick enough to catch up to annotate it in my lecture slides notes. So I use the headphones to just listen to important stuff. Or sometimes I want to watch videos about things like watching a Khan um, can Academy or anything like that. So I have my headphones around the corner to help me with that and I can do that without disturbing anyone whenever I'm making my notes. So I'm just setting myself up in the right position to start writing the notes. And by the way, sorry it's upside down as well. I'm just finding the right position to make up my videos, but I really want to upload something out there to motivate others. But well, I'm also new into this, so we can always get there. So I'm just making my uh, my topic um, 
it's just simple heading i can't really make any artistic writing in terms of i found that in terms of calligraphy i've tried to learn but it's not even my thing it's not my thing so i've just tried to just go with my normal handwriting and capitalizes and just to make it look nice i just use my highlighter to just make more just a little bit of design to it but that was that was all about it it was, was nothing massive just something simple All I then do is start making up my lips. So what, what I do is I know um, I decide what I want to do. So this time around, I make sure all my soft topics are written in the colored Moji pen and the main notes are written in black. So that's just to differentiate what I'm doing. So I would understand personally so myself that, okay, this is the topic, this is the subtopics, and this is my main notes. So that was all about it. That's all of how I make up my notes. It's not very, very intense it's not very very like special way of making notes it's i find like it's like i said initially it's personal to you whichever way you like to make your notes just make it personal to you to be to a point where when you want to revise you're happy to pick up your notes and revise it that's all and i just what i do is i just highlight important points and also use my um sticker notes to make excess um extra points that i find out online while making up my notes and also writing out notes i found out that it really really helps your studying but while you're making up notes you're actually studying at the same time because you actually find you find out that you're reading through at the same time while you're writing which is very very good so that's it about how i make up my notes i hope you like the, this video if you did please give this video a thumbs up and share it how with your friends and i'll see you guys in my next video have a good day bye